Hello and welcome to Lake News Now on KRMS TV 32. I'm Matt Markovy. Today's top stories, scary moments at a lake area festival over the weekend as a rogue firework explodes close to attendees in parked vehicles. It happened at the OzFest in Rocky Mount during a show put on by Ozark Fireworks. Numerous witnesses at the scene indicated that the firework exploded near guests of the event, shattering glass in some vehicles and setting off the airbags of others. Some vehicles also had their door handles blown out and received damage similar to what a baseball-sized hailstorm could do. Five of the spectators and one fireman on the scene were transported to the hospital, and at least 20 vehicles were reported damaged by the blast. And the much-anticipated start to the filming of At Nyangwa's End, which is a full-length drama featuring and based at the Lake of the Ozarks, has been put on hold. Producer Gina Goff, an independent producer with ties to the lake area, says the ongoing labor strike in Hollywood is forcing a delay of the project. At Nyangwa's End is the brainchild of Canmonton graduates Bo Shore and Chase Elliott. Goff says the mood among the key players and everybody involved in the production remains upbeat. After already gathering lots of B-roll, plans are now to start the actual filming of the movie, hopefully sometime in April 2024. And that's your Lake News Now. I'm Matt Markovy.